It happens often, maybe too often, drivers with dogs sitting on their laps while the car is moving. 22 News reporter Ashley Afonso found out if it's against the law. They may be cute and cuddly, but driving with your dog on your lap could cost you. Not only is it dangerous, but it's illegal. If you do have your dog on your lap and you're driving around, it is impeded operation. An officer can pull you over for that, uh, can issue you a citation. But more importantly than that, if you were ever involved in a crash, that's your pet's not going to survive being on your lap with the airbags and the force going forward. So we definitely tell people don't do that. A slam on the brakes at 30 miles per hour means a 50 pound dog could lunge forward with the force equivalent of being pushed by nearly nine 170 pound men, according to researchers at MSPCA. But don't worry, that doesn't mean you can't bring your furry friend in the car with you. Jacob from the Good Dog Spot in Chicopee recommends you get a doggy seatbelt. The passenger seat is okay if the, if the airbag is off, but normally we recommend them sitting in the back with a buckle like this, can be attached through the seatbelt so they have a little bit of protection, a little grounding, um, definitely in the back seat. There's also options like this one, a hammock for your dog that hooks onto the headrests and prevents your dog from jumping in the front seat. According to a AAA survey, nearly 60% of people have driven with their pets, and more than 30% said it can be distracting. In Chicopee, Ashley Afonso, 22 News.